Well, Essentia Health Pharmacies are now offering curbside pickup to safely serve visitors. Each Essentia Health location has created a designated area where staff members will bring refilled prescriptions out to the patient's vehicle. Like many of the curbside services being offered across the state, all essential health locations, including Brainerd, Baxter, Pequot Lakes, and Pine River, are now offering pharmacy services through a drive through system. In light of everything that's going on, uh, we wanted our patients to still have access to pick up their medications. I we understand some of them may not want to physically enter the building, uh, so we're providing service where we'll bring it out to them at the curb. Uh, to help them get their medications. Essentia Health is working to protect both patients and staff by limiting the amount of in-person contact. Visitors should call ahead or use the online refill webpage for a smoother transaction. Uh, if they can call, contact the pharmacy ahead of time, that helps because that way we can get the information we need uh, in the system uh, and make sure it's uh, quicker when they show up. If they happen to show up at the building and ask for the curbside, that's fine. Uh, we just ask that it might take a few more minutes to get everything going before we bring it out. For residents who don't feel safe leaving their homes, mail order services are also an option. So there is a sign at the main door here to the clinic and uh, each pharmacy here in Essentia should have a sign out uh, that will have a phone number they can call. Uh, that will go direct to the pharmacy and then we can take care of what they need. So the mail is an option still with that. Our mail comes from our prescription service center in Superior, Wisconsin. So as with any mail, it takes time to arrive with that. So mail is still definitely an option. Reporting in Boxer, Chantal Calhoun, Lakeland News. Curbside pickup is a convenient solution, but walk-ins are still welcome. Lakeland News is member-supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.